Hey guys, it is James here with Appalachian DIY. Got a very cool little tool here to show you guys today. The purpose of this tool is to make Honda crank shaft pulley bolts come out super easy and super quick. Uh, you can get these on Amazon. Uh, Lyle actually makes this socket, but you can also get them from your tool truck. Uh, it's about $20 on Amazon and about $40 on the Matco or Mac uh, tool trucks. So before, when removing Honda crank pulleys, uh, our options are basically uh, an irregular impact socket with an impact or a breaker bar and a pulley holding tool. Well, the pulley holding tool is uh, pretty annoying and time consuming when you do this on a daily basis at work or just regardless, it's, it's just annoying and it's a lot easier just to use an impact. The purpose of this tool is to allow you to use an impact on every single Honda crank bolt that you get regardless of how stubborn it is. Uh, I've used this probably 20 to 30 times over the last few months and it has not failed one time. Basically how it works is the mass of this socket uh, is essentially like getting a bigger hammer for the job. It, it has more mass, it's more weight, so the impact, uh, the impact force of your impact gun is actually magnified so it gives it just a, just a lot more punch and essentially it, uh, it works. Okay, for this first test, I'll just be using a standard 19mm uh, uh, deep well impact socket and just take a look at uh, how this 1200 breakaway torque foot-pound uh, impact struggles with this uh, bolt. Okay, now we're using the same gun, same air compressor, same air hose, same everything. The only difference is, is that we're going to be using the uh, Lyle special 19 millimeter socket. Amazing. Alright guys, so no joke, regardless of how much you pay for this socket, even if you only use it one time, it's worth the 40 or 20 dollars that you pay for it. Obviously you need a good air compressor and a good gun if you're doing this at work. I'm sure you already have both of those things. If you're doing it at home, this may not work for you because you really do need some good airflow and a, uh, a good air compressor to make this uh, socket do its magic. Alright guys, that's all I've got for you, so uh, thanks for watching and I will see you next time.